Hey everyone, this is EG BrainSim, and I'm going to be talking to you about this latest update to the Xbox One dashboard. Uh, if you're in the preview group, you would have already loaded it, as long as it's turned on automatically. And for everyone else, you'll be getting it later this month. And there are a couple small little changes, like the addition of a controller low battery indicator, which is which is nice and small. But the big thing I want to talk about is this activity. As you can see it on the this left column right here underneath the gamma score, you can see those two little people in a conversation they're having. Basically what this is, is it's called activity alerts. So under activity alerts, I don't have any new ones, but basically what it does is it kind of makes the the feed much more uh, interactive as you can see over here. So now I have this activity feed. So I can look up and uh, one, it gives me a snapshot of everything that someone's doing. So I see they added somebody friend, made a clip, uh, they can add me as a friend, they did an achievement. But the thing that's really cool about it is the interaction. So say if, uh, let's just use this good job in that achievement. Over here, we can now like it. And furthermore, this is a share button. So if you click this one, you can share somebody else's success. Either you can input it onto your activity feed, and now it's on yours for everyone on your friend list, or you can send it to somebody on a message. Now, this is the big part that I'm really interested for, especially if everyone out there who has Xbox One who wants to be getting some of their clips on the YouTube channel, this is gonna make it really, really simple. So I wanna show you how. One, all right, so let's go here, he made a clip. So I'm gonna click the clip, and now I can watch the clip without actually going into the upload studio, uh, which is quick and easy, and it's pretty cool, because you know I can look at it, you know, it's good, it's bad, whatever, not. He got some nice sniper kills. I can like it, why not? I can also comment on it. I can say, uh, good, good job. And that'll pop up right on there. So I, me, said, good job. I can also report it. But now this is the big one. So what I can do is I can go on, I can share the clip. I can put it on my feed, but more importantly, I can send this clip to somebody. Now, what this means for everyone is I can send it to see uh, this rocks. And I can send it to, uh, let's say, who should I send it to? Uh, let's send it to, ba, 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 ba. let's send it to Jiggy. All right, so I'm gonna send it to Jiggy. This rocks. And I'll say YouTube says hi. Exclamation mark, where are you? There you are. YouTube says hi. There you go. So what you can do now, if you have your own clip, have your own activity feed, you can now send me your clip in a message directly to me. You can even share it on your activity feed. You can do so much more with that. Instead of having the clip in the upload studio, me tracking down your profile, go to upload studio, find the ones that you have. Now you can get the ones that you have and send it to me in a message or everyone else on the media team as well directly to it. Now there's some also some other cool stuff with this update that uh, more for branches that we can do. For an example, let's get got something to say. Say I'm signed in on the uh, EG collision tag. I can say, um, let's go say, Titan, fall event tonight at 7 Eastern be there So now what that does, so now EG Collision Tag is sent out on their activity feed, this one. So everybody who's friends with that branch tag will see Titanfall event tonight at 7 Eastern, if I could spell Titanfall correctly. Be there. It's simple. It's easy. People can like. So if you click on this, now everybody who's friends with that can also comment. So they could say, you know, uh, what type of event it's going to be. Do they have any questions? They can leave updates if they're going to be late or coming or not interested. They can like it. Uh, it's really cool, and then obviously the, the person who posted it can also delete it, and it deletes it from all the fields. 
So this is just really, really cool. Um, some other things that they added, this popular games over here, you can see who's playing what. Um, it, it's kind of neat. But this ability to send me your clips perfectly and quickly is, is, is fantastic. And I really hope people start doing this. And the potential of listing events on a branch tag for everyone to see is fantastic. There's there's no way to put it. Great potential. Now there is something else. I don't know if it's actually going to load for me properly. No, it doesn't look like it is. Um, I'll do another video on it shortly whenever it loads for me. But basically it adds a friends portion between home and store. And it's a one-stop place for all friend information. Games they're playing, achievements, feeds, everything. Um, someday uh, that'll probably be coming in the September update. But for now, that's the activity feed. That's what we can do with the activity feed. And I hope that everybody, once it's going to be doing, once it's published for everybody, uh, we'll be using this activity feed all the time. Thanks for listening.